Ouch. Get that mosquito. Hello, cuties and cutettes. Whatever you would say to a guy. <laughs> we are back on the snake shed porch. We've done nothing because we're waiting for supplies to come in. It's just a lot of waiting around. Nothing's been done. Sorry to us, sorry to you. In this video, it is kind of sad. We always gotta throw a little bit of reality at you. This is summer. It is raining. This is when snakes are really crossing roads because it's flooded and they're moving to lay, I almost said lay their eggs. <laughs> Birth their babies, maybe lay eggs. I don't know. Some are laying eggs. Yeah, I was like, some of them are doing that. Before we get started, we wanted to warn you that this is gonna be a sad video. A graphic video. Snakes are crossing roads. And as you know, in Florida, there's tons of traffic. So hundreds of snakes, turtles, frogs, maybe thousands, are getting every day on these roads. And when we find water snakes, you know, they're about to give birth and they do live birth. So we cut them open, they're dead. I just wanna mostly sure her, mostly her. She's, she's the dirty, dirty, icky one. No gloves, no love, except I don't wear gloves. And <laughs> so we cut them open and we get the babies out. And if we get to them in time, the babies thrive. They're doing good. We keep them for a few days and let them go. But sometimes they're too undeveloped or we don't get to them in time. They've already suffocated in mom's belly. I don't yeah. know. I guess so, they, they have a, a lot of people don't know that snakes give live Okay, karate take. A lot of people don't know that snakes give live birth. So there's snakes that give live birth and there's snakes that lay eggs. All of our venomous snakes give live birth except for the coral snake. And then most of our snakes that live around the water give live birth, like all the species of water snake, uh, garter snakes, ribbon snakes, uh, Florida brown snakes, swamp snakes. Not mud snakes. Not mud snakes, which that. is strange. Oh, we had a horrible situation with DOR mud snakes. We found two and within them, we found 88 eggs. Mm -hmm. So it's just a really tough time of year for us because we love wildlife so much. We try to save it, but there's mm -hmm. just injured and dying yeah. wildlife everywhere. Owls, Allig I've heard oh it at gosh. owls, alligators. Everything's dead, so we try our best We've to seen at one, least save something. Yes, one to two owls hit by cars every single day this time mm -hmm. of year and probably five to six alligators a night. It is just brutal. But let's kind of show you what our nights consist of, especially water snake wise, because a small win is a win. Yes. So when mother dies, we could at least save one baby or sometimes tons of babies. So let's get to it. Yeah, most of them we... Yeah. Oh yeah, uh, those of you that were with us in the last video, you remember the cottonmouth relocation and the rattlesnake. This week, a male showed up following that female's pheromones. It was in the exact same spot and that the- myself. And she had to go, she went and caught him without me. Hey, tortoises. Hey, oh, look at that monster. Tay, that is a giant. How's that not huge? I'm bigger. That is a giant, beautiful green. She's huge. That's like the, go back off the road. You don't need to be crossing, girl. You're, dude, that is giant. I really thought it was a python at first. Okay, guys, we just got on the road now. And uh, this is gonna be a fast paced video because there's just a lot of stuff moving. And a lot of cars, so it's hard to film. Yeah, everywhere we go, tons of cars. So we're just gonna be showing you every animal we find. Boom, boom, boom. We're not gonna have a lot of filler, just moving quick. Because what we got to do, try and save as much wildlife as possible today on the roads. Boom, boom, boom. What do we have? What do we have? Ooh, that's a beauty. Gonna move this guy across the road. Hopefully he's well behaved. We're pretty close to the coast guys. So he's probably got some mangrove water snake influence. They mix with the Florida water snakes this here and create some really funky ones. Yeah, yeah, he's dead, dead. You know, yeah, skull friend. Oh, skeeties. All right guys, unfortunately our first victim and this is what we had told you about. Big old pregnant snake. Yeah, she looks like she got hit a while ago. Babies probably won't be live, but let's just show you. And sometimes they are. They were fully developed too. I don't know, a little young. Usually when they're not this developed, we can usually save one or two. Any movement so far? No. They're pretty checkered ones. Yeah. Would you eat the yolks? No. For $100 each? No. Unfortunately, once the snake has been hit, they start, you know, the babies lose the oxygen and they Oh, there you go. Look at that big, big cluster of them. Yeah, these are underdeveloped. What a bummer. Ew, why is a spider eating a dead baby snake? I've n that is wild. Another one. And we just saw two more. That's a lot of babies. Their eyes are blue, they're dead. They were fully developed. These would have made it. Yeah. 
Tays on another one. That's a giant green. Oh, that's awful. She's huge, babe. That's one of the biggest DOR gravids we've seen. Dead. They're dead. Just squeeze them all out. Just see how many. That is insane. Okay, a massive green water snake got hit. I mean, it's a five foot snake. It's, it's over five. It's five and a half. Right, cut her open, see if she has babies. Okay, ready? Yep, there you go. I think she might have already given birth, right? Okay. I have to get back. That's a five and a half foot green. Holy shit. That's so sad, guys. Oh, I would have loved to save her. Tay, you got him? What is he? Oh, yes. That's a nice one. Look at those black borders. Holy smokes. I thought he was dead in the road. He was just so calm. Beautiful. Oh, he's pooping on me. And guys, these are, are such a beautiful native that they constantly get misidentified as Burmese pythons. I mean, you did you did think it was one just now. I did. So. I did. I did. I thought it was a python. Man, South Florida has the best looking corn snakes. That is beautiful. Look wow. Look nice patterns. So I just got some blood on me. I just realized he is injured. You know what? I, there's been a lot of owls out here. I wonder if it was an owl. Yeah. We're going to let him go. Snakes are pretty resilient. And if he dies, then he will be food to something. What happened to our little friend? Bugs are bad. <laughs> oh, oh no. God, what is that little frog that jumped on? He's so cute. What is this? Look, he has snake fungal too. Oh, he does. He does. Oh, my God. There's a tiny toad. Ow. He's a southern toad. Let me get a little. That up. is so cute. Wow. So cute. Why was he riding on a dead mud snake? <laughs> <laughs> oh, here, get him. Oh, he's back on. He's back. What? He's what? Like, How did that happen? He's like a magnet. Oh, oh just get, get out of the road. Oh, wow. Oh my god. That's little dude. Come on, dude. Come on. Go. Oh my god. I don't want to. I don't want to like pick him up because I'll crush. <laughs> He's like you. I love him. Okay, so back to our guys. This is a mud snake. This is. Oh, it's still like clenching a little bit. This is one of my favorite snakes here in Florida. They're just so beautiful. This one obviously was hit by a car, so it is in the process of dying, and that's so sad. A lot of the mud snakes here have this snake fungal disease. You could see that on them. So not only is that against them, but also being hit by cars all the time. So that's really sad to get. Oh man, that was a beauty. Really high black. Look at their beautiful bellies. There's theories that they mimic coral snakes and these are an aquatic snake that feed off of giant aquatic salamanders. And that's like the only thing they eat. Oh, that is so sad. These are one of my favorite snakes to see too. Okay, so this is the cottonmouth that I relocated and we're gonna let him go. We actually, he's very skinny. So we threw a frog in there and he ate the frog and then threw it back up. It was too big of a frog. He's got a swollen belly. Good luck, bud. No, guys. Beautiful king snake. Why? Oh, no. It's a really dark one. No. Go be gator food, girl. That's sad. Oh, that's sad. Another sad sight, a baby gator hit on the road. So we just met up with our friend Alex, the Florida mullet man, and we just came across this female green water snake who was hit by a car and she's very pregnant. During all of the confusion and everything going on, I totally forgot to flip the camera into horizontal mode. So it's gonna be in vertical mode and just bear with us. Uh, the footage is still very interesting from here. Ready, Alex? Holy smokes. Give me my coat. They're alive. They're alive. <laughs> oh my gosh. Give them a little jump start. They're breathing. Must stimulate. Stimulate. There you go. Oh, he's wiggling. Woo. Oh, look, that one's squiggling. He's, he's trying to get out. There we go. Alex. I know a thing or two about sacks. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. A lot of babies. Yeah, gotta get them out quick though. Okay. I'm trying. I'm filming you guys. You guys are doing awesome. Ring out the mom. There you <clears throat> go. Look at those, Alex. Buddy. Oh no. Is he crawling away? <laughs> oh, they're all squiggling down in there. Alex, do better. I just don't want them to drown on it themselves in there. Look how lively they are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm covered in snake slime. Fetal snake slime. 
one, buddy. Jesus. Okay, let's put this over here. Can she? Oh, that one's crawling away. That one's crawling away. All right, buddy, you need a day or two to recoup. There's so many. What's your guys' record so far for oh, saves? Uh, saves only in the 20s. Well, this could be more than that. Well, we've had 40s, but they've all been dead. There we go. Stimulated. It's like virgin status. I'm done. Get in there. Come on, buddy. Look at them just coming to life. This is insane this how is many... They're all alive. <laughs> this is amazing, dude. Yeah. Oh, look at her breathing. Look I know. Breathing. First little breath. How cute is that? Oh, look, that one's crawling out of her. We can back. There's more, more coming. Oh, There's God. more. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, oh, let, me just, oh, let me film this real quick. Yeah, sorry. Wait, I dropped one in in the sack. We got to this one in time. I oh, do. you got one? Yeah, go get a snake bag. Oh, let me... Let me. First breath. Come on, buddy. Yeah, we got to... Yeah. Oh, red, that one red, got red, ran over. Right. That's sad. Oh my gosh. Boop. That's a record. Alex, grab that one's tail. See it? It's right there. I don't want to hurt him. No, just get him by the tail. Boop. He's so slippery. Oh no, is he? He's alive. He's trying. I think we Come got on. him all. Come on, buddy. Oh no. Oh, there it is. Right there. Guys, so much fun. Ah, oh, son of a gun. Oh, the fun of herping. All done. Yeah, I fixed the tire. Got it. Let's go. It's our little hat hanging out, our little buddy. <laughs> He's got no body. Okay, guys, so cut open a lot of snakes. They were too far gone. There was hundreds of babies we could not save, and that is so disappointing because some years we have good years. I mean, you know, we're just saving a bunch and we can't even handle it. And we'd much rather the mom survive and give birth and just live on their happy, merry way. But we try our best. But we did get to save. Show them. Paper let's... towels. We got to save paper towels last night. Look at them all. Look at them all. There are 42 babies. I mean, that's great. 42 babies that would have died. So on top of the hundreds that are already dying, there would have been another 42. But we, we saved them. Save They're babies. so cute. I love green water snakes. Like, if they weren't such annoying captives, I would love to have a pet green water snake. Just but we let them all pets. go. 42 pets. If we find an albino one someday, we'll keep it. Oh, if you guys um, have been following us for a while, we have an old video of doing this, and we found a two-headed one. Yes. Two yes, yeah. Well, let's add the link to that. That was the... I love weird animals, as you know, my chihuahuas want one eyes and stuff but we got a two-headed baby water snake out of a mom once of course it was the only one that was dead there was like 30 live babies that was the only dead one i was so upset one day we'll get an albino one day we'll get a live three-headed that'd be great but for now we have 42 sure. normals as usual and uh we're gonna take them out with us tonight and let them go yeah and hopefully they live or get to feed animals because things eat them so let's go Okay guys, so it's been two days. We let the snakes recoup, absorb their yolk sacs, and they are ready to go into the wild. Ready? Let's let them go. Okay, little dudes and dudettes, whatever you guys are. <laughs>